Hey guys, I was hoping to not have to work on Memorial Day, but I've got at least two, two and a half calls to do. I had to stop and fuel up, but we're on our way to our first emergency call. Come ride with me. We have arrived. Let's see what the problem is. Okay, up top, I mean outside, I found the um, condensate line that must have been from right here was dripping because there's water in the emergency drain pan. But the P-trap had been removed. So let's go make sure we got that hooked up right. She is cooling now, but like I said, this peach wrap was not hooked up. I think that's the right drain. Right now, I'm not real sure though. We got almost all the water out in the emergency drain pan by vacuuming it outside. I want y'all to hear this though. You hear that blower pulsating? It makes me want to look at a filter. That's a pretty straight shot with the return. to add algae tablets so we'll get to look at the coal when I do that. be able to look at the hole.
I think we need to take a close look at the filter and recommend. Now the outdoor coil was the outdoor coil was nasty too. So I'm gonna recommend cleaning them both. We are draining great now. So the immediate problem was fixed. I'm coming out here to check pressures to verify my suspicions. I wanted to show you something that I saw earlier. Checking superheat and subcooling. I know this has a TXB, but um, I want to know by checking pressures if that coil is clogged enough to recommend pulling and cleaning. I'm checking right now to see if we need to pull and clean that coal upstairs. Because <clears throat> it's starting to get dirty. Okay, I was speaking with a homeowner and I've got a 21 degree subcooling, 14 degree superheat. And that's largely because of this dirty coal out here. <clears throat> It's Memorial Day, so we're not going to do it right now, but I am going to quote her a price on cleaning this pool thoroughly. I mean, taking the top off and these sides and cleaning it really good. That head pressure is getting on up there. It's hot inside. <clears throat> that coal inside may not be dirty enough to pull and clean. I got a superheat of 14 degrees. You know, it's really hard to tell. With head pressure that high, I would think my suction would be higher. Head pressure suction, subcooling, superheat. Okay, so I was unable to get a good view of that evaporator coil until I got home. We are going back to um, chemically clean the condenser coil. And when I'm there, I'm going to mention to her that we probably need to pull and clean that evaporator coil as well. 
but that filter was clogged. She has lots of animals in the house and it was full of hair and dander. So we are going back and there may be significantly more work to come out of that. That system's not but like two or three years old. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next one.